Hi, I'm Nader Parati, and I'm here to talk about deep brain stimulation for Tourette syndrome. What is DBS? Deep brain stimulation is a pacemaker for the brain. Just like we're all familiar with cardiac pacemakers, which send electrical impulses to the heart, a deep brain stimulator sends those impulses to the brain. What we think it does is that it resets abnormal rhythms that develop in the brain when patients have neurological or psychiatric illnesses. And those rhythms help to reset the brain into a more normal pattern and hopefully improve symptoms. DBS success rate. The success rate with deep brain stimulation for Tourette syndrome is variable. On average, we expect people to improve about 30 to 50% with stimulation, but individual results can vary from as little as 10% improvement, and some people will get complete remission of their symptoms with deep brain stimulation. When to consider DBS. Deep brain stimulation should be considered as a treatment option for Tourette syndrome once all medical therapies have been tried and exhausted, and once someone has undergone cognitive behavioral therapy. In general, we'd like to see patients evaluated by a comprehensive team of neurologists, psychiatrists, and neurosurgeons with experience and expertise in treating patients with Tourette's syndrome. We will consider patients for surgery once they reach the age of 16 or 18, depending on their symptom severity and how much it's affecting their quality of life. Is DBS FDA approved? While deep brain stimulation is approved for diseases like Parkinson's disease and essential tremor, it still is not approved by the FDA for Tourette's syndrome. Still, many centers that have experienced treating Tourette's syndrome are providing the therapy after a comprehensive evaluation. If you're interested in deep brain stimulation, you should check with your medical center near you to see if they provide these services. For more information, you can visit the Tourette Association website at Tourette.org.